this video, we will be attempting to beat the Balloons Tower Defense 6 Rogue mod by only choosing the middle path at all times. Can we do it? Let's find out. Welcome back everyone. We got the Balloons Tower Defense 6 Rogue mod, a command dev, and exactly what it is. Let's check out Cubism. We get five options, palpable, easy, medium, hard, and palpable. We'll do medium, primary and military magic support towers. We'll do all those bosses. We're only doing balloon areas. If you don't have any bosses, it crashes. Balloon areas, just easiest one. Why not? Now I did try to mess up with alternate rounds but that messes up the scaling for a hero xp is i got to roll that like level 19 at round 55 but we're gonna just jump right into it now with our hero um i don't know Sadia would be really good on this map let's do Sadia, and then let's get like mm, super monkey super monkey Sadia we can already afford let's put it into this little corner actually i think this corner might be better now Sadia, she can pop camo once it would really help but yeah, every 20 rounds the smell of sludge and algae permits the air that's balloon areas comes every 20 rounds we need to get a good starting base right off the bat our first decision so with each card we can go left middle or right we're doing middle so we have to do middle but the top right number that's the amount of towers you're allowed to get the path they intend you to go through so if i click on this and i place a drew down i can pretty much go any pass but it pretty much maxes out at tier two i would rather do heart thorns and heart of thunder because that is so much better than heart of thunder and i also want to get a super monkey down pretty quickly too because that would be really good too now we can place down a nice super monkey let's place it down right in the middle okay well of course as soon as we place down a super monkey we could get a super monkey the rerolls do stack up so let's use one we could get four beast handlers i don't want beast handlers never mind spike factory i'll take four spike factories super monkey down i think i run like a dark champion no no we can only do two things so ultra vision and then plasma blast Oh, we could try to get Oban. If we get Oban next one and pick Druids, that would be pretty good. But you only get one tower of the choosing one. All right, one more round until first balloon areas. I know Sadiq is only the one who can actually pop camel ones, which is not the best, but not the worst. Yeah, this guy definitely does scare me because we gain no money as soon as the round's over. Let's do a laser blast because that will help out a lot. And of course, the abilities. Hopefully, we can get it. All right, we got first rip. That's good. Close to popping, actually. And there we go. That's first balloon area is gone. We needed that for sure. We definitely needed that. Now, Spike Factor, which one's that? Oh, that's just even faster production. I think the Heart of Thunder can hit lead ones. So we don't really need Spike Factor yet. All right. Another path we could choose from. We have the Dart Monkey. I don't really want that. Especially Max at a tier three. Oh, by the way, they all come around at every five rounds. So let's do a reroll. Yeah, Heli Pilot. Is that faster firing? So we can get like Pursuit. Yeah, that's kind of annoying. I mean, we could get Moab Shove actually. Moab Shove be good yeah yeah let's just place one down do faster darts faster firing moab shove quad darts and then pursuit actually i think it might be every 10 rounds every 10 rounds we can get actually get a new monk or new tower really okay now oh, this is actually really good ice monkey three of them second path you can pop lead and camel ones and ice shards but we can just stack a bunch of them in this little corner pretty much yeah just all three of them right here there we go every single one is a 302 now we're cooking another round another balloon areas uh i don't like this guy at all all right let's do plasma blast and then knockback and ultra vision okay he's actually making it really far though hey there we go oh we get another hero round four we get another hero uh i, I don't know if i want to use pat fusty so let's do a reroll see what we get i mean trigger jones i never use him I, i'm not actually gonna not use him because if i place it down these heroes split the xp then in the meantime i think we get a couple more druids no just get heart of thunder for each one of them and then do druid reach look at this moab shove our team is looking actually pretty good i think this could be an all-star team oh my gosh let's go heli pilot 400 apache dart ship actually goes crazy with ifr i think this guy can make it to at least round 60 so let's just add another one bam our first hero four he's gonna go crazy only problem is we definitely need something for round 90 ddts well we got 40 more rounds we're fine okay another one. Oh my gosh that makes you so mad we could have got super monkey mortar monkey i don't know what the middle path is Oh, let's do reroll. I don't know more to monkey middle path. Monkey sub. Ah, another reroll. Monkey. 
Unlucky Buccaneer. Now, since we're on medium, we can actually generate cash. So this could be really good, actually. Favored trades. Oh, that's good. That is really good. Yeah, let's just place one down. So he generates cash by himself. I'm trying to get like three of them, I think, in this corner. So 50 cash each round for both of them. So that's a thousand cash each round. Oh, another balloon areas. Oh my god. Well, let's hope the Apache driver ship puts him some work. Oh, there we go. Yeah, let's add another one. Why not? It's already at level 10. That's good. Oh my gosh, no way. Now we get a monkey buccaneer. That means I have to sell at least one. Actually, no. So let's sell one. Let's just max it out already. Let's do crow's nest. Sure. Yeah, so we could probably have a couple of them and then just have these guys down here, really. So now these guys are just generate cash and I'm going to put a couple of them. Three of these guys right here. Oh my gosh, no way. We're getting all the monkey buccaneers. We could pretty much run favorite trades, monkey pirates, and the top path. I want to reroll. Overclock engineer. Nah, another reroll. Dartling gunner. Dartling gunner is actually really good. We could place them right here. Yeah, let's do a two, two, zero right now. ZOMGs and balloon areas. And there we go. We just do a path. Sure. Actually, he gets camera protection, right? Yeah, all monkeys gain camera detection at level eight. So let's just place him down. He could be pretty useful. I know he's going to split some XP, but hopefully he gets, yeah, already level five. What? I think it's just because we're so far in the rounds. Dartling gunner. What, the mad or whatever? Yeah, let's do that. Let's place another one down. Just right behind him. Yeah, so now everything has camera protection, really. Block on right over here. This is definitely all-star team. This guy's already level 12. It's because we're just so far in the rounds. So now everything has camera protection. Yeah, so we could pretty much place down five more aircraft carriers and then it's upgrade one to a five to zero. We already beat the DDTs. Okay, round 90 done. Oh, I forgot. We can get paragons, really. I mean, sure, but we're not actually going to use monkey paragon. So we don't have enough money. Carrier flagship. Bam. First tier five. We do bomb shooter. Nine of them. Let's reroll. Wait, we don't need banana farms. That's a thing. We don't even need it. We just do alchemist. Why not? We just place one down, I guess, right here. And then just do acid mixture dip. Like this guy's already he's level 20. Oh my gosh. Saudi's level 22. So I think it's because they just stack up over time. Yeah, so now we just have all four abilities we can spam. Okay, another blue nail. There he is. Oh, there we go. We exactly passed round 100. I guess that's good. But I do want to see that using any abilities, how far our final squad at round 20 can actually make it. You know, ring for zero MGs. Actually make it really far. Oh, our first BAD. Okay, we actually take it down decently well. Yeah, all right. Bomb shooter. That could be really useful. I just get bomb shooter. Why not? Another BAD. Gotta spam all the abilities. Actually, no. Let's do striker Jones. Yeah, yeah, we gotta play striker Jones. But let's see after one BAD. Let's see how many levels he actually gets. He gains seven levels instantly. That's actually crazy. I say we just get a bunch of aircraft carriers down here. Okay, so we could get Beast Handler, Ice Monkey. Right, I just got three more aircraft carriers. I mean, even if they're all the way down over here, they still travel there. Oh, round 120. All right, this is it. I mean, might as well just spam every single ability we can. I'm just gonna keep on spamming. Do we have any rips? I, I couldn't tell you. I, I really couldn't tell you because everything is in there. Okay, we do have one rip, I think. Okay, I think we're getting close to it, really. Oh, there we go. So aircraft carrier is definitely carried. We could continue. Let's see how far we can actually go. Okay, so that wasn't that far, honestly. We made it to round 127. We lost to a fortified BAD. Not really surprised. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure to subscribe. It means a lot to me. I might do a right path, actually. Alone, maybe in Popple. Who knows? I like this mod. I like this mod a lot. And that's all I have for you guys today. Enjoy the rest of your days. Peace.